Do you think I look like I'm from Sacramento? You are from Sacramento. You don't have to do that. Well, it's nice to make things neat and clean. You ready to go home? Ready. Her hand moved behind his head and supported it. Her fingers moved gently in his hair. She looked up and across the barn, and her lips came together and smiled mysteriously. You've been listening to The Grapes of Wrath by John Steinbeck. If you... Our college trip took 21 hours and five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, when are we, let's just sit with what we heard. Are you serious? Well, we don't have to constantly be entertaining ourselves, do we? I wish I could live through something. Aren't you? Nope. The only exciting thing about 2002 is that it's a palindrome. Okay, fine. Well, yours is the worst life of all, so you win. Oh, so now you're mad. No, it's because just you're being ridiculous to to because music. you have a great life. I'm sorry, I'm not perfect. No one's asking you to be perfect. Just consider it. Would do. I don't even want to go to school in this state anyway. I hate California. I want to go to the East Coast. Your dad and I will barely be able to afford in-state tuition. There are loans, Your brother, your very smart brother, he can't even find a job. He and Shelly work. They have they jobs. They bag at the grocery store. That is not a career, and they went to Berkeley. Your father's company is laying off people right and left. Did you even know that? No, of course you don't, because you don't think about anybody but yourself. An immaculate heart is already a luxury. Immaculate fart? You wanted that, not me. Miguel saw someone knifed in front of him at Sack High. Is that what you want? So you're telling me that you want to see somebody knifed he right in front of you? He barely right saw that. I want to go where culture is, but like New York. How in the world did I raise such a Or at snob. least Connecticut or New Hampshire, well, where writers live in the get woods. Get into those schools anyway. Mom! You can't even pass your driver's test. Because you wouldn't let me practice The enough. way that you work, or the, or the way that you don't work, you're not even worth state tuition, Christine. My name is Ladybird. Uh, well, actually, it's not, and it's ridiculous. Call me Ladybird like Christine. you said you would. Just, you should just go to City College. You know, with your work ethic, just go to City College, and then to jail, and then back to City College, and then maybe you'd learn to pull yourself up and not expect everybody to do everything. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Let the Lord be with you. And also with you. Welcome all of you back to the start of a new school year. All the Xavier boys and Immaculate Heart girls. Machines because no one wants a muffin with that many calories. Do not ask me, Mr. Bruno, is this going to be on the finals? Or Mr. Bruno, is this going to be on the midterms? Because I'm not going to tell you. That is none of your business. <laughs> Those aren't the rules. This is my house. A reading from the letter of St. John. We're afraid that we will never escape our past, and we're afraid of what the future will bring. We're afraid that we will not get into the college of our choice. We're afraid we won't be loved, we won't be liked, we won't succeed. There are the classics. St. Augustine, of course. Aquinas, my favorite Kierkegaard. Oh, wait until you hear his love story. It will make you swoon. El segundo tema de los desafíos globales. And the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, kingdom. Oh.